في على اسماء ولدي كنياتهم الله يرحمهم وشنو فد يعني فد شيء عليهم مختصر بس تتذكرين عنهم this is Muhammad. I remember his games, his toys, and I always remember his words. Mother, I will not leave you alone. The second one is Ahmed. Before they left home that day, they both asked me to give them a big hug and a kiss. I didn't know they would leave forever. It's been three years since a grisly suicide bombing killed two of Umm Musam's three children, Muhammad eight and Ahmed seven. They died in 2005, along with 32 other children who had gathered near an American military patrol in their eastern Baghdad neighborhood. The security is improving in Iraq now, but many families in this country are still grieving. On Sunday, the Iraqi government proclaimed the anniversary of the children's death, the day of the Iraqi child. Parents attended a ceremony at the Ministry of Labor and Social Affairs to mark the occasion. Children perform songs calling for an end to sectarian violence. Previously, the families of the dead children received 150,000 Iraqi dinar a year. This year, the families said the government gave them posters instead of money. From the day of their death, my life has not been normal. I've been sick. I've been sick. I faced hard times. I am fragile and it is hard to sleep because I have the heart of a mother. And you can imagine how the heart of a mother would feel in this situation. I carried them away from the bombing site. They were covered in blood. Kais Otewi Yassin attended the ceremony with his daughter. He lost two children. Abbas, 11, and Ali, 9. The day before they were killed, my sons went to a neighbor's birthday party. They were very happy at the party because they got good grades on their final report cards. This is what I remember of their last days. I always thought of them as friends more than sons. They were really my friends. I miss them every moment and every second and every hour, believe me. We lost our children, but we still wish all the best and good things for other people. I hope the next generation will take their place. The security situation is better now. It was a big loss for us, but they are gone. They are birds in heaven now. The improvement of the security situation now will not return my children. It will not return my sons. It's impossible. Nothing will compensate us.